everyone, Yo-Yo Artsy here. In this video, I will be playing Teacher Simulator, the most fun and the number one educational simulation game by Quality Limited. Basically, it's where you get to explore what school is like for teachers. Grab your pencils at the ready and make sure you're prepared to answer the questions. But watch out, because if students might do something bad, you might want to catch out the bad cheaters in your classroom. Anyways, Teacher Simulator also features sending bad students to the principal's office, answering your students' questions, and as well as students presenting their tests to teachers and marking them to see if they pass or fail each subject and many many games such as hall monitoring, blackboard erasing and more. That way every day you'll become a better teacher in no time. So do you have what it takes to be the best teacher in the world or will the students' failures get the best of them? Now is the time to find out and before we start I recommend you to subscribe, like, comment and enable all notifications so you'll never miss out on my content uploaded every week. So without being set, let the learning fun begin. Welcome to Teacher Simulator. But before we start learning, we're going to choose a teacher. It could either be male or female. Uh, I don't know what to choose from, but I'm going to choose the male teacher because he's really kind. And now we're going to do a quick tutorial on Teacher Simulator. We're going to ask the class some questions. Question number one. Which animal is pink? How about the girl with the magenta shirt? Cow? No, you're wrong. And that boy? Flamingo? Yes, that is correct. Question number two. What does LOL stand for? Hands up if you know. Laugh out loud? Yes, LOL is the abbreviation for laughing out loud. Perfect. Two questions were answered correctly. I earned $134. So let's continue on. And here we have tutorial number two going to check their test to see if the students were right or wrong. So here is the image of a cat and we're going to tick. So cat is correct. Uh, this is not a hippo, it's a dog, so it's wrong. Uh, this one's an elephant, so the girl gets a B in her test. So this one is a cabbage, no, the answer is a carrot. And this one's a car. Uh, it's not beans, it's pizza. So that boy gets a D. And what about that girl over here? Uh, it's not a sheep, it's a lion. And fish, check, Eiffel Tower? Yes. So she gets a B in her test as well. Yes, it's the end of the day. Three exams were marked correctly, and it's all thanks to me. Oh look, there's a new game. And the game we're playing is Hall Monitoring. Let's see, what subject are we going to study next? How about food class? So you get to sharpen the pencils. This one's perfect. Nearly there, perfect. And the last one, get ready. Perfect! Now we're ready for class. Alright, now it's time for my favorite part, monitoring the halls. So monitoring the halls is something that we need to do in order to discipline the students whether they did something good or bad. Alright, let's start with the girl. Alright, so basically she was helpful in class, raised hand in lesson, and then she refused to participate. So she has to be sent to the principal. Next we have, um, so basically she was being honest, but she has mostly her bad behavior, spat on the floor and played with glue. So she has to be sent to the principal with both of those things. Oh, now it's time for the worst part. It's time to stop the bully. We could spray her if we want to. It's time for food class, the first subject of the day. 
Oh, they're checking their test. They might have been drawing a picture of food or something. So this one is a strawberry, correct? And then we have an orange. Wait a minute, this is not an orange. This is an apple. So, no, it's not that. Last but not least, wait, this is also wrong. It's not a pineapple, it's an orange. So, that boy gets an automatic F. It's the end of the day because we marked in three exams correctly. Oh look, we have a new mini game. And it is exam supervising. TV and film, the best offer of all time. But we get to watch the video ad again. So this is TV and film. So this is where kids get to learn about, uh, about TV shows and films and different movies. Now they're ready for class. So this is the day of a TV and film exam. So we're going to find three cheaters and might step them outside if they cheat in someone's exam. So I was thinking of the word exam makes me worried. So that boy's cheating over here. So I disciplined him. Hey you! Gotcha! And, and now to find the last cheater. Hey you! Step outside right now! You know what? I think it's best if we tell the students what to do. So they have to be followed. Oh look, we have a new mini game. And the mini game is blackboard erasing. I like that mini game. Now it's time to choose science. Just thinking of sides makes me worried. Now it's time to clean the whiteboard in order to start science class. Now it's time to check the results to see how well they did. Ah, I see. They have some very complicated science questions that were really confusing. Oh, yes, this one is about animals and wildlife. So, no. Animal for Australia. And, yes! He gets a B on the test. This one's quite easy, and the last one is difficult. Uh, a wolf does not eat flies. Tigers don't eat grass, and animals that live in rivers, fish. So, she gets an automatic D. Wow, I'm surprised. Class, some science questions. Which is the hardest substance available on Earth? Diamond? Wait, what? I didn't even know that. What is the center of an atom called? A nucleus? Yes, that is correct. Ooh, one question was answered correctly. Not bad. Now it's time for um, business class. I decided to sharpen the pencils in order to start business class. Ah, I see they're taking a, a business test, and now it's time to check the results to see if the students were right or wrong. This one's a restaurant. Nah, on the Euro. Yes, a theme park. Yes. One is a USB. Wi-Fi. A pound. Good. I didn't even know that. The boy got an A plus. A printer? No. Bitcoin? No. A diamond? A Wi-Fi? Check. Wow, being a teacher is super easy. 
We just have to check the students' results and see how well they did. Two hours later. Hey, you know what? Being a teacher is fun. I can't wait till we do it again. Now it's time for the last subject of the day, which is, um, you know, uh, let's stick with sides. So we're going to clean up the board. I'm done checking all the tests and some of them passed and some of them failed. Now it's time for their science test. We have to find the cheaters while the students were taking a science test. Hey you, I saw someone cheating. Get out! And now we're going to find the next cheater. You, step outside. And whenever those students cheat, they have to be sent outside. Such as you, step outside. Yay! Three cheaters were found. That concludes another school day. The teachers will be seeing their classes again in the next lesson. Alrighty then. So that brings our teacher simulator game to a close. I hope you all enjoyed it and loved how that turned out as much as I do. Please make sure to check out my YouTube channel and review all of my past videos and analyze them whenever you like them or not. And make sure to do at least three things. Subscribe, like, comment, and turn on all notifications to see what video I should do next. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye!